wreck him, but I think his throw wrecked himself. Yeah, I, I no, it was almost good. There. It was almost a wrecking, yeah. but then he called us Giles, and so you know, <laughs> Keto dead at long. Yeah, great segment from uh, from that stunner and Trace as well. Uh, hey, he's always there trying to do that's something. That's funny. But he's on the T side now, and well, it's big rather. <laughs> Moving up catwalk. Nice, Hugo, yeah. Yeah, I was looking at the no, odds maybe, at the top. Maybe Trace was right, The actually. size is swapped. Yeah, you didn't ask for us. You got us anyway. Complain, cry, is free. And shots are to Carrigan. Quick tap to Tizian. And here they come. Flashes in. Carrigan nice. back for more. Ooh. And Brokey's here to level the playing field. Tapson, six health. Surely no chance in this clutch, even with that headshot. It's just too much. Bob goes tumbling down. And so does the round. The big. I like the little hand motion from Carrigan, pumping himself up, cooling himself down, maybe. Good start to this one from the uh, the IGL of Phase as he takes out three to win them that pistol. Mm. It would be a lot of credit to Phase, I think, if they're able to take down a big that looked this good at this tournament, right? We've seen kind of... You know, I feel like we've seen two sides of Phase so far. Yeah. And it always just feels like on the day, you know, you never really know what version you're going to get. Uh, we'll never forget the the, the Fnatic game. Yeah, that right. much is certain. A dominant 12-3. 11-1 at one point in yeah, time. Draw three hard. Dropping the ball and then getting absolutely smoked on the second map. And even when phase of win, I mentioned this when we were just on cam, like that, it's been kind of scary, right? It's been, you know, oh, they're, they're looking unbeatable, then they drop a map suddenly, and, and oh, no, the series is super close on the third, but they do win it. You know, it's not, it's, <laughs> it's, it's not good for the heart, I'll tell you that much. Big, on the other hand, have come in and impressed a lot with a new player with Gade. We've seen, uh, you know, different roster changes, uh, maybe hold, hold teams back, you could say. Um, not this one. So, not a lot of time for Big, but the results are there. They're looking for more in this round. That's a bomb for Tabson. They've got to go get it, and Rain will not give it up too for him. Twist moving in, and it should be a clean anti-force for FaZe. Yeah, I mean, Bomb just kind of sells you down the river there. There's no cancelling your play or plan once FaZe have it dropped, and so it's a flawless round as they take a 2-0. Tabson calls a tech, and we wait. It's kind of interesting. What would you want to role play as? You've already bought me costumes, Harry. Remember I have. that what we wore in the studio last year with the with the mullet. Yeah, but that wasn't role playing. Move away from this metaphor. <sighs> All right. All right, Hugo. Save it for the bedroom. Ooh! Keto won't. Dirty Deagle onto twists. Olaf trades. And that's that one Deag just getting passed around. Gade's now going to have a go. And so these Glocks may as well live until Gade dies, and then they can just keep shuffling that over, trying to make shots out of rain, get his attention diverted. Gade moving through middle now. Oh, could have been a big one. Instead, he goes back to Cat with his team. Yeah, this should be, you know, a pretty decisive round from this point onwards. I, I doubt you're looking at this one and rubbing your hands together if you're big. But hell, anything you can get is a pretty much nil investment from you. So let's see if they can survive the famous. Carrigan doesn't hang around. He's going to get flashed back in by Brokey, but isn't peeking on the back of it. Gade now dead. That is the one Deagle removed. And so the rest of the Glocks are just dealt with in a pretty, you know, pretty decisive fashion there. But now we got the guns coming through for big. Now we got the big guns. Right? Uh, yeah, that's that's technically like, true. Yeah, because they're big. Nice. Tabson, no uh, AK for him. He goes right in with a Krieg. All righty. I'm not against it. I'm not against anything Tabson decides to do. sirson has got his AWP. Running right down middle to start. He's going to try and scope up. Phase already crossed three B. Thinking it's a, a rush. It is not. Broke with his AWP on car, pushed through the B tunnels. Oh, where's this? This is going over the top for the skylight. It's not going to work for Gade, but maybe it blinds certain positions in the tunnels. That's a nice idea there for FaZe. And forget the flash. Olaf comes up with the goods. Yeah, that's a really cool idea. I yeah. hope we see like the, the, the intended purpose behind it, right? As you mentioned, Gade was not blinded in his position, but I can't imagine that's what it's designed for. I imagine it's for someone, you know, holding near the mouth of the tunnel. Yeah. 
because all tunnels got mouths and right now Brokey's the guy looking to chow down Searson with this orb trying to get across into the pit now can he do it flash goes over Brokey dodges oh, it and he's what? not even needed that was a wonderful bit of spray from rain there just traced him through the sky down into the pit this is a good-looking phase round, if I've ever seen one. Yeah, Karrigan just heard the steps. He's, both his teammates on A just dropped into spawn. Oh, my God, this is wild. Karrigan with the backstab, Dink on the second. Uh, this is perfect. You may as well go through the smoke. Try and find that right timing as phase try and peek from the B site as well. Rain tagged up. All the molly might do it for him. Rain goes over the top, and that's why we see the double mid to B smoke off, but not in this round, and it's come back to fight big as Rain has a beautiful round on this CT side. Loves a bit of dust, does Rain and finds a fourth for FaZe. What a what a perfect call as well for Carrigan, hearing everything down middle, all of FaZe were able to dive up. They're empty, you know, like wow. the moment one That's person deep. leaves, yeah. everybody leaves, okay. bro. Okay. But other than that, you can't get in. This is where if you pay Harry enough money, he'll shout out your warm-up server IP. He'll just read the numbers out. Yeah, like the log me and Hamachi days, yeah. like getting your mates <laughs> on Minecraft. <laughs> Wow, that's a throwback. Yeah, wow, yeah, yeah, I'm full yeah. of them today. So look, it's just a pistol round now. Little lower tunnels control out of big while they wait around in top middle. They've got the hinge smoke and they're gonna look to go up, but Olaf watching for it. Just wanna be careful. He's gonna trade out with Brokey and yep. the AWP chiming in with that opener. Already a good start for FaZe. That kill's pretty much untradeable for big. They might look to deal with this orb, but they might just try the avoidance tactic oh. altogether. Gate tagged through the doors by Ow. both Olaf and Brokey. And now Carrigan's trying to get a mow down Momo. Here he is up at the front. Womp womp, double kill. And just Tabson left to beat. Brokey's going to steal that one away. And FaZe are up 5-0. Oh. Yeah, and we're 5 alive. It's feeling fine to be a FaZe Clan fan for now, like we say, for now. There's always time for things to go wrong. Big looking to just get on the board. That was an eco again. You can't expect too much. Tabson goes back to the creek. One and five to begin this day. But I'm not a Tabson naysayer. Still plenty of room. Right now, FaZe, yeah, commanding uh, the CT side. They're all over the place. They're making good reads. They're making info plays. Now a long take for Big. That's going to force some respect finally, but not from Carrigan. He pushes right up. Oh, my God, he beats the AWP. Searson missed flick. It's a slow day in the office right now for Big, and FaZe are coming in feeling fancy. Brokey double scope. That jump just gave him the info. He might have died otherwise. Now he gets a chance to go back for more. Oh. Brokey doesn't give it up. It's lights out from Brokey right now. Him and Carrigan at this A bomb site have been a force of nature, mate. And Brokey's waiting for flashes. Now trying to peek around this smoke. Look at how many bodies are on the other side here. And Brokey Ooh. anymore finally taking it just they one step care. too far, but the flashes keep raining in. And so does the namesake. He doubles up to close it. Phase six and oh. And I get the feeling, right, that after yesterday, you could tell they were all pretty dejected, right? You know, there yeah. were some tweets from the FaZe guys as well. They knew that, ooh, that turned into a very ugly series. But sometimes that's what it takes with these guys, you know, to light the fire underneath them, to pump them up a little bit. We are getting a thick and pumped FaZe clan right now. That much yeah, is for sure. Exactly. Yeah, bulging. And that's good news for FaZe. Right now, this is Big's map pick. Keep that in mind. Inferno coming up. Mirage to close. And so... Yeah, flat map night. That's fine. So Xbox smokes straight away in. Face again, <laughs> lean along. I want to know what kind of a game Twists is having right now. Like, everyone else is just wrecking, you know, like, can't see the set of foot wrong. Twists has seen four people and three of them have killed him. Yeah. That's the extent of his game so far. He's got a double orb now, so going to be able to anchor down B. Face seems oh, to think bigger coming yeah. their way. I was about to say, right, yeah, you got this heavy B lean, and the little utility that Gade's throwing in is only selling that even further. But big, if they'd committed to this A bomb site push, yeah, you had to get past Brokey's orb. But going to B, that's going to put you right uh -oh. in this three man stack. Yeah. Twists, Welcome. he needs the power of the no scope here. He's good for two. Now that orb's been retrieved on Tizian. What? Oh my god, Olaf isn't looking. Now they weren't ready for rain, but he's suddenly got to hold on to a B bomb site that's hanging oh. in the balance. That's a, a series of weird events there. That's a swap doors for Olaf. Not aware, maybe, right? Not not thinking. Spent too much time with the uh, the inverse. 
Oh, I've got you, yeah. I, I'm covering, don't worry. Well, not really. Flash over the top, here they come. Gade, gonna dodge the first, not the second. Searson hits his shot and Brokey has to decide, is this really worth it? We've got money. I could, I should, and maybe I will. Oh, Searson's out of the round, and Gnarly. now Gade, who has yet to poke his head up. Brokey doesn't know he can read all he wants, but Gade hits the shot, and big. That was an eco win, half bought. They get on the board. Yeah, that, that's a real shame, man. You had the triple B set up, you know, you, you had all your pieces in the right place. Twists opens up with this double in mid. This was great for Tizzy to spam the smoke and then like just gets given that kill entirely for free. I almost wonder if like, you know, the cool is, oh yeah, I'm looking at door, I'm looking, don't worry. But yeah. like there are angles where you, yeah. as we just we learned. Do, yeah, we do see <laughs> a, lot of, a lot of players still get caught off a little bit by that, you know. Not aware what you're open to. Oh, Keto legged there, Twists. He's now kind of trapped, right? But are they going to keep on the pressure? They haven't got a mid to B smoke. There it is, late. But you keep doing this. You keep throwing the hallway smokes left and right of middle. You never know where they're going to go. There's that other smoke as well. We saw Rain jump on the box before. So big no, they need to get that in if they want to be going for mid to Bs. And while it denies the info for Rain, Olaf might have heard those steps in tunnels. They're jumping on wood. Now they've got to line up Util and explode his five. Olaf, easy peasy, takes down the low HP Keto and tucks in. Oh. Twist is blind, he can't help out. Olaf's dead. Twist just finds the angle in time. 15 health though, they're already in the bomb site and Rain's tagged down low as well. Oh, Rain might be screwed. Yeah, the Molly's gonna burn him out. He had nowhere to go, nowhere to hide. Tabs and cracks open this B site. Now they look to get across. Carragher dead in the window, trying to peek ahead of that bomb plant. Very fortunate that Big uh, both jumped over to his angle. He had a gap. If you cross safe, like he would have hit that for sure. So Big actually, he, he never knew they were even in the bomb site. He never had that information until the plant came in. And you, it's just audio that tells you that. It's uh, a shame for FaZe, but yeah. Big have figured out the weakness. That's what I was about to say. little nerve-wracking now, right? Because up until this point, you'd had a lot of these A plays come in. You know, look at the look at the, even the, the kill feed, mate. Like, you know, the um, the guys on A are having a great game right now. You know, Brokey Zorp has been tearing it up. Carrigan's looked really, really good on these, uh, on these A holds where he's just the only guy having a hold down cat. And so, you know, they win that round on the Eco B play. They go back to it, and this B hold's starting to get a little bit, a little bit worrisome, right? Olaf gets one and done. The flash is really, really good at disrupting the entire game plan there, to be fair, out of big. Right, the idea was Olaf never was meant to re-peek into that. Yeah, I had Twists to. was going to watch the run up, and you know, while... So, all right, let's go. 6-2. Hope you all enjoyed that. You know, who would you rather go to space with? Fast out long. Tizzy and oh, everyone's hopping, everyone's jumping, everyone is blind. And Carrigan trying to get him under the blue bin. The nade comes in, Tizzy and expected a Molotov, but it's after. It burns him out. He already used his smoke, leaving a lot of room, a big gap for the flames to find him. He was only 10 health. Big, I mean, they've been going for these B plays, right? So that was always the game plan. They were just taking long to keep up the attention of FaZe. Now they've done that, giving only two CTs on B. Twists, though. He's got this orb from back plat. Green Molotov as well, really stalling this play out and buying time for Rain to rotate out middle. He's yet to do so. Twist is just dropping every bit of utility he's got. Finally, the push is going to come in. No time for the smoke. And so he'll smoke them instead. One, Olaf helps out. The flashes again are good for big, but they come too late. Two kills before the first flash even pops. Yeah, I mean, that's a real sigh of relief for FaZe, right? They're finally able to put a stop to one of these B rounds. No longer are they going to get disrespected here so much. Also, you know, Twist's taking heads off even while he's done in the AWP. It's impressive. Yeah, how does he do it? And so this is a very, very long save here out of big. Their options are out the window. But at least on the back of keeping these guys alive, you're going to have a buy in the next. You've still got something to fight back up against this 7-2 scoreline. And FaZe probably aren't too keen on hunting yet no. either. They want to build up some of their own money.
Yeah, they just lost two in a row. You take the win. You don't complain. See, it says CSGO on the ball. You like that? See, uh, that's uh, a piece of trivia for you. The reason it says that is because that ball uh, is in Counter-Strike Global Offensive, which oh, wow. is what CSGO stands for. <laughs> it's a fun, fun fact. Yeah, that's pretty cool. The yeah. kind you might find in a Christmas cracker. Yeah, this was weird. I think TZ was just expecting the molly to come in first, and so that's why he used the smoke already. And you can see there's massive room, but it was actually a nade, and that did so much damage, and he just already had no smoke to use. Only option would have been to run into the smoke, and they would have sprayed it. So, dead man regardless. Sirson sits in a Molotov as well, but no peek is given over. Faze do a good job of avoiding death there. If Rain even went for a wiggle, he's likely gone. Util coming up, cat side, they're going to flash their way into this A site. Bigger done with B. They want to do something else. Yeah, they're throwing these corridor smokes out in middle again. Actually, this time they don't have the CT one down. They do have like the CT smoke for an A play. I'm a little nervous because Tabson was like just out on an island with the bottom short, Ooh. but it's all good. Tizian's opened up. The flash gonna get Brokey off the angle, right. but only for a moment. Now there is another guy coming out late long, but right now Brokey's oh. having a health count up in A. Tabson oh. will remove him. And Rain wrapped by the late Gade out through long doors, shot in the back of the head. This is a big round all day long. Oh, it felt like Kito was about to get the angle twist, though. Able to save his gun at the last second, catch those CT players moving through, and lovely long timing hit from Tizian. He just walks a smoke. That's infuriating. That's really what wins the round there for Big, getting the long control, forcing Brokey's attention back, and even though he wins his fight, he was put to two health, couldn't stop Tabson from crossing. And so Tizian, the real MVP of that round. Big find a third, and this is competitive, yeah? The score may be pretty one-sided, but Big, you can see them starting to pick up steam and figure out that it's not just B that's free. We can get it done with these A splits as well. Building into their T side of their map pick. Faze just trying to hold on to their money. When Sirson's trying to get fancy with it, he's rushing down middle. A lot of balls to go for this, but he's going to make it work. Not getting peaked. There is Brokey's AWP on short, and both AWPs miss their first chance at opening up in this round. Sirson, very, very mobile, was just spotted getting up on the Xbox after running down mid. Now he's already posted back up over here. In top middle, holding for a, uh, a crossing player. Smoking the long doors is well timed for Carrigan. It's going to deny big this map control. These corridor smokes go out again in middle. These must be very frustrating if you're phase. Yeah. Especially considering Big have used them for something different every single time, and sometimes they just throw them and they don't even move with them. So it's just Fade's constantly trying to keep that rotate player looking for info. brokey has got info, he's got a kill as well. Carrigan, scared of the long smoke. Sears has seen him, and Carrigan jiggles out. If you waited, they may not have cleared that corner. Now it's up to Brokey being collapsed upon from long. That other A player trapped in spawn thanks to the smokes. And now FaZe have lost the A site. Both Carrigan and Brokey fall without anything to do. And the flank is dead as well. That's a round, really. FaZe should accept the consequences. Big do a great job of baiting them into middle there. And you've got to wonder, a couple of, you know, missed shots come through for FaZe, missed timings. But it's all by design for Big. Starting to see them warm into this T side after all. Oh, I'm getting nervous for Rainy. Like, it should all be fine. No one should come through these long doors. And so I imagine he's going to get away scot-free. With a guy like Tizzy in there, you never know, man. Tizian's wild. I've heard that. Nah, it's all fine. It's all safe. 
And now FaZe are in a bit of a weird spot. Big are right where they want to be to make this little mini comeback happen. They're still in with a chance of winning this first half out on their map pick. And considering, you know, it's a pretty dominant start to the day for FaZe here. This is a nice spot to find yourself in now. Finally starting to feel like you're regaining some control in this matchup. Yeah, this is where it gets easier as well, although you've got two guns. We've certainly seen FaZe win, win rounds like this already in the Pro League. This should not be one on Dust 2. Big going to move out long, and there's no one here to stop him. You definitely want to check out Pit before you commit, though. It's always in the back of your mind. Players hiding in the dark corner at the bottom. Boost up. Do they send the pistol up? Yeah, there's only pistols here. The rifles are on cat side. Twist dropping that simple smoke. Rain could even go up on top as well. And he's going to play behind the smoke, so I like this. Trying to stop a bomb plant instead of getting into the site. Oh my god, they're oh, boosting. Boost means, oh, boost that's boost means the boost. boost. And the bomb goes flying through the smoke. This is weird. Oh, has oh, got a shot as well. I don't know what's going on. The pistols are doing it. Bomb secured, but Rain's ready to win the round. Oh, well, he does fall off, but he's going to correct it. It's all on Searson now, and a 1v4. Yeah, he's going to get rushed down. We Two tapped that. out by Brokey with the USP. Oh, and yeah, you know, yeah. Twist and Rain did great with their guns, but let's talk Olaf for a <laughs> moment while all the attention's being pulled elsewhere. Olaf's just jiggling with a P250, and he's making it look easy. Yeah, There's just so much attention being drawn, right? Not just the boost, but bigger thinking about the bomb with the smokes down, the getting spammed through it. Twist takes the opener. Awesome. It's just so Gross, gross that Twist is holding for the boost, yeah, like over the grimy. top of that smoke. Very grimy. And now FaZe, that was an eco, that was two guns saved. Again, the whole- Oh my god. Oh, ah, oh my Everyone's god. Everyone's blind and Tizian converts the spray. I don't know how he does it. Oh, he might not make it out as well. 10 health off the nade. Broke in the bomb site. Long's lost. He's got to worry about everything right now. Taking down the first and oh, the second yes. as the flash comes in. Yes, Brokey, give us more. Make it happen. Tabson saw the P250. He wants his revenge. Yeah, but will he get it? See it so oh. Death through the wall. It's only the tag. That, that would send me over the edge. Tabson has retrieved the AWP. We know he used to love the AWP. No. Is no, he going to love no. it so much now? Facing off against Brokey. No, he's not. Brokey's on for the ace. Last guy's in pit. Come on. You know Tizium is here. Him and Carrigan had that horrible fight right at the beginning. Oh. Come on, Brokey. Hard Give shot. us all five. It's not easy, right? This pit angle, especially when you're this low, this could just be feeding. But there ever was a time to feed the beast. It's when you yourself have a full tummy. Here we go. Big Brokey. There it is. Oh. In the round, you love to see it, and that is how FaZe Clan find their ninth. Brokey, take a bow. He's having a game 19 and 5 right now. Don't put a stop to this guy. Oh my goodness, lights out and literally flashed on this kill as well. And I don't know how he lives against Tabson when he gets the orb, right? That will bang something, but then Tabson even takes a shot. He has a chance. Brokey's just dancing on the bomb site and even patiently waits for Tizian to leave the pit, knowing he has to eventually come to him. I feel like next rifle round, you're, you're going to try and lead into a B play. Yeah. I, I think you stay I'm away sure from have read that yeah, as well. Yeah, I bet that's what they're thinking as even well. Even in this round, Rain's gone down lower out of spawn. No one was playing top mid yeah, but look, spawn. Man, he's so. cleared all of this yeah. now, and so these B players go lol. <laughs> And so they just start to rotate over towards A. Yeah, that's how the comps sound. I've watched Karagun's voice video. Yeah, no, that... <laughs> oh, flashes are interesting and the kills come through. Oh, look, gets deeged and Kito with two. Okay. Don't Kito. give it to the German Deegs. We always talk about them. Yeah, he's not ready for T-spawn, though. The longer phase live, the more room ha rain has. Uh-oh. Oh, no. No, German no, no. German Deagle out. German Deagle out. Everyone watch out. Push the German Deagle arm. Keto now a 1v2. This was a one on five. He's got three out of five. Two left. An HD clutch, maybe. Keto and his pistols, mate. Oh, why did they peek him? Why did they give him the chance, Hugo? Have they not seen the dual Beretta video? Have they not seen what this guy can do? And they're both oh, aggroing they, long they as well. They won't even know. When he plants, they might even think it's B. That would be the obvious move here to go into that B bomb site. I wonder at what point the phase realized this is an A play. Do they always know? Oh, no. Oh, they're oh, going to be. No. Oh, boys, Faze. you've been sailed down the river on this one. The German Deegs. 
Oh, the German D, just one of them looking to do it. Keto. Come on, baby. Give us something impressive. Brokey, sure he might have not. stolen one away with an ace. Don't but jump. This is Keto's time to shine. This is Keto's round, baby. Up in the bomb site, they're trying oh. to peek him together. And Carrigan will lay him to rest. It is a damn good try out of just one guy for big. You can't be too disappointed with the outcome of that one. It's 10 on the board for FaZe. They still get the round. Oh, we're all thinking about what could have been. Yeah, four for Carrigan. He at least holds on to that one. That was terrifying, man. Look at these shots. Even doesn't get the reload off in time. Four rain. Gets spotted. Still hits that while being aim punched. I was scared he was going to Carrigan was going to get shot mid-air as well. Pre-fire. USP tap to close. And that keeps FaZe in it. Yeah, Keto. You know, it hurts. You wanted the round. You felt the round. But sometimes it's just taken away. Good shot from Searson on the cross. Look, He's been barely go. quiet in this team side. Remember when we said about how, you know, you might anticipate a B play? We do have a triple B lean early on yeah. for FaZe once again. It's kind of old, right? So big one to at least try and sell that they're not doing this. And Carrigan comes to them. Oh, it's not pretty. That's given bigger way back in. They might even still tempt them into B and into two. Twists, second door, which is tagged, of course. Otherwise, you're going into Life Gamer Brokey. Now, you don't want to mess with Brokey when he's having a Life Game. Oh, lovely from Rain, and he's out of there. I mean, really, he's actually still kind of hanging around. Will he get punished for this? Brokey's got his back. He's holding down long, but Rain will fall. Brokey's got to do it all. Out on the barrels, out on an island. He knows about this orb, but short, but that is the extent of it. He's trying to go for this peak oh. now, spotted by the long player. Tabson's Krieg taps him out. Olaf Meister at the cross. They've seen him. They know about him. They don't even have to commit. They've still got time oh. here, but Searson will oh. nail the shot. Okay. And it's Twist Sorp now asked to step up in a one on three. He was tagged right at the start of the round, crossing to B. And so now Searson's just got to finish the job. The orbs will clash on short. And I'm pretty sure he would have heard the scope in. Searson doesn't miss these twists around oh. the corner. Actually, headshot to Searson, now up onto an AK tab. Okay, it's not, but I first time I heard it, I was a bit shocked. Either way, man's got bars. 10 to 5, big gonna need the same on this comeback. It's their CT side, it's their map pick, and FaZe are set up for success. Tabson trying to make plays happen, and they chase him. Carrigan with a yump, taking him down. Now it's Tizian with a grenade, they're already up and past it. Two HEs ready, he drops, they hear it. They might save it for the bomb instead. Oh my god, they're coming to you. Oh! Oh, oh my god, that Little was almost legs. a double, yeah. Tizzy and shooting feet. Oh, that's a nice nade as well. Where's Gades? Long way away, it's just made it to spawn. Uh-oh, Carrigan doesn't want to die, but doesn't really have a choice. Now, there is this mid-wrap on Rain. He will get one, but now they're up and past him. He's got to get run. back to Cat quickly, because if he wants to play around this bomb, he needs to be on the Catwalk instead. Oh. Twist is going to lock in both the kills, and the round belongs to FaZe Clan. That was very, very back and forth, right? When Carrigan, you know, falls trying to take that long control off of Keto, I start to get nervous, I start to get worried. But there's a couple of nice responses there, right? I think Brokey and Twist doing a great job up here in the site of just holding the fort. While that's happening, Rain is going on that bottom mid flank. And if you recall, actually, the other day, it let FaZe down, uh, you know, attempting that. It meant that, I think it was Carrigan who did it. He was like yeah. T spawn, uh, CT spawn wrapping, and he couldn't stop the bomb plant. But Rain, he, he learned from that. He fired one bullet, killed one person, straight back to yeah, Cat, so he away. could play around the bomb. No, great, uh, great reaction, great play. Wasn't needed anyway, big. Oh dear, B's gonna get crunched now. The smoke may buy you a few seconds, but that's all, surely. Gade getting the reload in. They give him that respect. Nate follows, Gade's low. One more D would be fantastic, but can't expect it of him in that position. 2-1-4, big locked out of this round, already thinking about saving what they've got, and it's not a lot. 12-5 to five for FaZe, and they're gonna make matters worse. Ooh, there's a gun. But even so, FaZe are not far away from locking in Big's map pick in dominant fashion. That would be a statement, Harry.
Yeah, it really would. And, you know, we, we've seen these T-sides be problematic for FaZe, right? So I'm kind of waiting with, with bated breath, shall we say, till the rifles come through. But at least, you know, this time around, they find the pistol, they get the conversions. There's none of these little upsets that so often try to trip up FaZe along the way. And so they're going to be in a spot by the time that rifles come out. It will be 13-5 to FaZe Clan. And what that essentially means is, is they're like one rifle round victory away from stealing this map off of Big. If they go into this first rifle round, hit the ground running, pick it up, wreck the money of the Big squad, mate, it's pretty much over. Yeah, this is uh, not, not what we've seen from Big all tournament long, right? So quite a, a shocking game right now, but it's good to see out of phase. We know they've had these heights, they've had these peaks, at least in certain maps so far at the Pro League. And it's good to see them do it against Big, who really are looking for every win they can get, both teams two and one. So this one will have big consequences when it moves to you know the, the, that last day. and with uh, so many teams fighting for those three positions. Keto, more Deagles needed. FaZe hesitate, they wait. But five on four, the pressure's not on them. Oh, they've boosted up to Zian's Galil. Oh, but the smoke started to fade. Oh, oh my God, Froki's right there. He knocks the boost out from underneath Tizian. Tizian still takes one with him. Ooh, Carrigan Ow. in with the response. And now this cat to A play, well, they're walking into an empty bomb site. The red carpet's been rolled out for FaZe Clan, and in they come to pick up 13. How red's your carpet? I don't have carpet. I have... Uh, a pretend wood floor. Not Real my, pretend wood. My, how's, how does that work? What's it made out of? Just not wood, that's all I can okay. tell you. But it's made to look like wood. Just easier for spillage, you know? It's not like the classiest material ever. It's, yeah. But it's crazy. something. Well, this is something, all right. Something for FaZe. 13-5. We've got Inferno up next, right? This is uh, this is Big's map pick with Inferno as phases. We've seen highs and lows from FaZe on that map, but... Regardless of that, I I don't know. Don't know how you recover from this kind of scoreline. Yeah, it's not going to be easy. You know that much is uh, that much is certain. But it's not impossible, mate. Like I don't want to have to keep bringing us back to that Fnatic game and reliving the harrowing yeah. memories. And I think you know you are up against a better looking phase right now. But as I've said, these T size. They have sometimes been problematic. They've sometimes slowed down and really started to slip through FaZe's fingers. And, uh, you know, all of it for me is hinging on this rifle round right now. I think if FaZe win this, you know, it's it's pretty much as good as locked in. Yeah. It would really be impressive to uh, to have this one turn against you. No, you're right. FaZe, they're bringing a pace into this gun round. They won't even let these nades go out in time. Twist gets the kill the last second, but taps and swings the smoke and trades Olaf. Gade sees them get out B and won't let them get much further. Some tags come through, but nothing of note for FaZe. And Brokey's having a great one today, looking for the one on four. Gage crept himself into the bomb site. No way Brokey knows this. And so he's a dead man. Six rounds for Big, and they hold on. Considering that was the opening kill for FaZe, getting out middle, that goes very well for Big, who don't lose a single man past that point. Four alive, the AWP kept as well. And maybe hope after all for Big. Well, they're gonna try and bring that pace again, this time out through the long doors, but Carrigan burns in a Molotov, that's not ideal. It wasn't just the Molly that was wrecking him, he was also getting shot at, slowed down, you know, you name it. Oh, Brokey, the timing on this exit out of the tunnels is pretty brutal. He's just let them in through the top of it. And so now Big have got the info that it's not a B play. And Brokey is also at the mercy of this flank. He's still keeping it in the back of his mind. But you know how timings are in Counter-Strike. He's going to hold this for like 20 seconds. The moment he looks away, right, nothing's going to happen in the tunnels. Nothing will happen. Brokey will sit there for close to an eternity. And he'll draw his attention away for a millisecond to look somewhere else, not even doing anything anything wrong.
wrong, and then he'll get shot in the back of the head. That's just how it goes. Crumpling cookie here, Brokey. Yeah, I mean, he was ready for it at least. Yeah. But he won't be able to stop it, spray through the smoke and rain down to 10. Gets out of dodge out of harm's way. Keto here, though, looking to cause more harm than good. Oh, more aggro flashes and the spam for Rain is actually what sends Tabson in. He knows he's close and he knows he's blind. Twist smokes the molly, but he can't get Searson off the bomb site. 1v4. Olaf moving up long and with a nice tap to start, anything is possible. However, the time is the biggest factor. Yeah, and the bomb's on short and there's an orb holding the cross and... Oh, yeah, Olaf, I think he knows that there just yeah. physically isn't time for this. Gotta go. Doesn't want to... You know, live and then die after time. Maybe saving the orb could be big. It's going to be a tricky old save, but hey, they might let him get away with it. Yeah, they want money as well. Goes both ways. Counter-terrorists win. Dizian's trying to stop that save, but unable to do so. All right, seven rounds for big there. Well, they make so us believe. As far as my worries go, you know, I said if, if FaZe won that first rifle, this dish would have just been put to bed. And that, that statement was true. And they didn't win it. And so now it is an yeah. open field, you know. I Well, at least it's not like we've seen FaZe lose any you know, no. super one-sided games or give up a really nice match uh, to anyone in the Pro League so far, even days ago. Yeah, wow. I mean, so subtly put. I <laughs> uh, Brokey tries to open up with the... Oh, my God. There's just uh. Molotovs for every occasion. Oh, heartbreaking for Ray. And he dinks Tizzy and through the... Um, the pole. Oh. And the nade will get rid of him. But Rain's done great damage. Tizian is so nearly dead. Searson is the only guy you got to worry about over here at A. And you've still got a lot to work with in this round. The fact that Rain's Deagle does that could actually be a, a real difference maker here. They're going to try and go mid to B. Oh. And there's Brokey with the opener. Keto dead. Now leaves all the pressure onto Gade. We used to say Gade, always good for two. That needs to be true now more than ever. But he's sidelined by twists. And with that earlier damage done to Tizian and the fact they're just so far removed from this round, it's a safe call out of big. Huge that FaZe have been able to disrupt this momentum early on. Yeah, you will be able to rebuy, but uh, you're running out of opportunities now. Phase off the back of, like you said, just rains deep work. It's damage on A. It means Big just can't even consider retaking this round. Plus, you needed more out of one of the anchor players there. Gita got baited so hard. That first player jiggled out middle, and then that let Brokey set up with the orb. Didn't know who to fire at. Didn't really have time to choose. So 14 to 7. And you get a little worried, you get a bit sweaty for a couple of rounds as Big shows some form, but it is just up against such insurmountable odds. Look at this damage for Rain. Lovely Deeg shot. I mean, there's the jiggle on the corner with Brokey. Easy peasy. Nothing bad about that round for FaZe. It's a similar situation we were in just rounds ago, right? Where FaZe is so close to breaking the money that this could be their, their route to victory. They're taking this round a lot more measured as well. Hello. Corridor smoke's going down. FaZe looking to give Big a taste of their own medicine, perhaps. Probably laughing right now, saying, yeah. Not so nice when those smokes are down. You never really know what the intent is. Carrigan looking like he wants to try and fake this A plate. The bomb and Olaf grouped up over in tunnels. Rain's now moving around as is Twist. So this becomes a matter of, you know, how much attention can Carrigan keep on this A bomb site? How are they going to look to use him? He's flashing himself in for a peek. The molly further selling you on this idea that this could be a cat commitment. But Carrigan never had a smoke. That's the one downside here. He's not able to like really sell this in any meaningful way outside oh of that flash God. of molly. They're just going to go through and with Gade hidden close, 
playing the cubby. We saw Olaf in this exact same position. Will FaZe check it? There's Gabe with the first. Oh. Swinging a little too wide. Twist is going to trade him. And now with Carrigan on this late mid lurk to try and cut off rotations, this round would be undoable for Big. Man, that flash was so good. The rain was blind. He was just, you know, tucking in the cubby. He was just fully in the corner. And like you said, going too wide. Well, he wanted the kill, but Twist is able to provide a bit of cover there. And that's so sad that that's how it falls apart for Gade. We say good for two, but right now he is just getting traded on this B-bomb site. And 15 for FaZe with an unfortunate save out of big. Good fake as well, right? Even having, you know, not only Carrigan on that A site selling things on cap, but Twist was outside long earlier, spamming the doors. So big, all it looks like there with B being quiet is, you know, like you say, this cat to, cat to A split with a late long player, a very default T side round. Big don't really know. And and that's funny to see Big get faked out after, you know, some of their T rounds where they confused phase with corridor smokes, with you know doing that and going into A splits and then sending players through C T into A. You know, Big had a lot of Tom foolery in the T side and FaZe didn't fall for all of it. Well, no, it's not like Big even fell for that fake. They still had to and beat. But they had no idea of knowing until the commit comes in. It's just leaving it down to FaZe. And it's a perfect round out of them. Fifteen oh. to seven, dust two T, by the way. Olaf smiling. Oh, I could cry. Doing these consistent A attacks in the first half where Brokey was always in the right place. He's not been given these opportunities. Nice shot, though. That's a, that's no, a, I don't think it is. I think no, it was a nade. That was a nade. Yeah, yeah. They, peaked I was very a, yeah they peaked with a nade in the middle with a smoke blue. Well. Gates dead. He's gone from one for ones to none for nuns, and now FaZe are ready to close the map. Yeah, the bomb is late because it was on Brokey, and I don't think FaZe were expecting this much success, but ah. as long as guys like Twists are Ooh. able to hold off the rotations, there is nothing that Big can do. Dunzo. Bomb crossing late. Brokey spots one of these players coming through the tunnels. He is in. Ah. Oh, Keto coming in <laughs> with that Famous, but there's no way you're ready for Twists in CT, or sorry, T-Spawn. This is grimy, sure. and he's just wasting Searson's ah. time and taking heads off.